Hi, my name is Dex from My Consult, and since 2003, actually we have been helping business owners simplify their accounting systems. So if you like what we are doing today, support us to create more contents, do like and subscribe. All right. So in this continuation video, we will be actually looking at how we can generate depreciation with the fixed asset module. To generate the depreciation, all we just need to do is come here, press process depreciation. Okay, select your date range and then of course uh, as users you can actually select or group them based on how you want to do it and then the other option that you can have here is you can actually select your journal voucher format so some of my clients would like to have their own separate journal voucher number for purely depreciation then you actually can use it okay so for this example I will just use the standard JV number I will just press process Okay, so once I press process, the system will then come out and tell me for this month, what are the assets that I'm going to depreciate and then what is the amount that's going to be depreciated. Okay, so once you're done, we just press save and then the system will generate for me a journal entry. Okay, so once you close this, so sometimes you would like to check back what was the depreciation or what are the breakdowns uh, for a particular month. You can actually come here to open depreciation. Then you can see all the breakdowns and here if you press the JV number it will give you the depreciation say example like the PL item and then the breakdown for F and F furniture fixtures and motor vehicle alright if you want to know which assets are being depreciated over this period you can press the depreciation listing and then they tell you okay there are two things for furniture fixtures, there's a uh, 2 out of 120 for this fixed asset number 3 and then uh, VB S888, right? So sometimes some of my clients will say, oh, I want to see other information like example, like a uh, project code. Then you can come here and then you select like project code, alright? So now with the fixed asset module, you can actually compute your depreciation with just a click of button. So we actually hope you find this helpful and if you have any guide you'd like us to create, do leave it in the comment below. Thank you.